I drove up to the Woodlands and had a chance to walk around and even check out what the Woodlands Mall looks like on my way to play some music here at the Hyatt Centric Hotel. The Woodlands is an award-winning luxury master-planned community that's located north of Houston with a population of around 120,000 people. And the Woodlands Mall is a part of the center of the Woodlands. It's a two-story enclosed shopping mall within walking distance of popular Woodlands spots like Market Street and the Woodlands Waterway. And I was curious to see what the inside of a mall would look like. I remember when I was a kid, I'd get excited to go to the mall and I'd be walking around with a skateboard in hand and, you know, you could get a cinnamon roll and check out t-shirts at Hot Topic. But today, most of my experiences with the malls is just checking out these YouTube videos that I love to watch about the rise and fall and the death of the American malls. So I was curious and interested to see what it would look like inside. And this is Mother's Day weekend here in Texas as the air finally begins to feel like summer is coming on. So there were quite a few people inside the mall and walking around. So at least in terms of the Woodlands Mall, this one seems to be doing pretty well. And I guess it kind of makes sense when you think about the Woodlands audience. They're a bit more wealthy, so they got some money to spend for shopping. But I mean, malls today even aren't just about shopping. They're about more than that. They can serve as a community space. And when you think about the fact that there's basically a bunch of homes all spread out across the woodlands, they don't necessarily have a designated focal point for community, and the mall can serve that up. Especially in Texas, I think these places have some kind of opportunity because they provide AC, the air is nice and cool inside, and it's pretty rough out there in the summer Texas heat. And I looked into it a little bit of why malls today could be struggling, and they say a lot of it has to do with the death of retail, a lot of people shopping online. And so basically the models for malls is changing less from shopping and more from a kind of entertainment, like multi-use kind of thing where you could go there and exercise and have things to do and just a whole mixture of stuff. This one here in the Woodlands still has retail all along the edges like JCPenney and Nordstrom and Macy's. I don't think you're going to find too much live music here inside the mall, but I can tell you where they do have some around the Woodlands. The big major one is a bit of a walk away from here along the Woodlands waterway where they've got Cynthia Woods Pavilion. This is a whole amphitheater kind of place where they have really big bands like Brooks and Dunn and Dave Matthews Band. Along the waterway where they got a whole strip of restaurants, there's a few places I know of that have live music. The first one is called Goose's acre then there's this place called mahoney's which i've seen offering up live music there's also a place called the como social club i've seen live music advertised there and then there's a popular spot along here called market street and when i was walking around there i saw signs for their spring concert series where they've got music on thursday evenings ultimately i made it out to the hyatt centric hotel to play some music for these folks I had a good time playing my songs here on the second story overlooking Market Street. I saw you dancing on the stage with glint in your eye and a grin in your face. She's a little bit tipsy and a little bit lucky and the night was getting late. Drummer's eyes are glossy, Sam man's in another room. Your lover looks exhausted and your liver's working through. That booze and coke and cigarette smoke and lipstick stains on gasoline Guitar picks are flinging through an empty room nobody's heard of you Could have been the drugs, could have been the heat It could have been a shadow of a stranger on the street But whatever it is, it's such a sin, it's certainly a shame Whatever it is, it came along and took you away. Thank you for checking out this video. I'm posting all about touring around Texas and the music scene of Texas. So you could go ahead and click on my YouTube channel and check out all those thumbnails and see which topics are interesting to you. Give those videos a view. Thanks for giving this video a view and thank you for your support.